NCC Baseball. What's going on, sir? Good to see you. We are already pre-cutting and tearing into some blasters. Just got a little bit of retail. We're going to check in, hang out for a few minutes. Little coin. Those are the, remember the metal coins? That's where they came from. Oh. Asher's back there on a 2019 on his first uh, blaster of archives. Wait till more people Chuck, in. what's going on, sir? Uh, I've got Asher with me. I'm going to tear through a couple blasters in a pack and then I can excuse him when he's ready to cool off in the basement. Yeah. <laughs> but I've got a, Got a nice stack of stars and stripes for you to run through real quick as a lot or individually or however you want to do it. But hope everybody's had a nice, sultry, blistering Memorial Day today. It has been hot in this neck of the woods. Mango goodness and ice cream. Hope you're doing well. Like the name. Sam Arnold, good to see you, sir. A couple stars on the coins there. Nice. Let's see how the autofocus handles. Whoa. Mr. Yelich. Yeah. Back there with the coin collection. Oh. Two just absolute bombers. Hey. And the show. Hey, yo, Tony. Coinage. He's going to go through 2019 Archives Blaster. 90 degrees in Shot Town. Woo. Still got the AJ Puck Auto. I'm still debating it, Sam. I've uh, been making some sales, got some private sales going on. But uh, if, if you sell it before I get a get a chance to make a decision on it, by all means, sir, make your money on it. I know Puck's a, Puck is a good player. Puck is a good player. Let's go through a little retail real quick. And just while we're hanging out, I know uh, Papa Jay, I just spiced up his uh, break for tonight, which I haven't told Asher about yet, but uh, while he's going to do his mixer break tonight, uh, we did well enough in the sale uh, yesterday that, like I said, we always try to turn it right back into the community, but um, if you guys tune into Papa Jay's tonight after his mixer, I bought a 2017 gallery um, monster box. It's got two autos in it. And then I bought a 2018 uh, Bowman Platinum Monster with a couple autos. Uh, so he's going to break those live for me uh, directly following the break. So that should definitely be a lot of fun. Are these? Is this just the design? Or the yeah, yeah, that's the design of them. You're going to get two or three different looking designs in them, like the Chronicles. Like you're going to pull a few of those, a few of those. So like the one, okay. So but I, we're still I looking the... for the Hot Rooks and the Eloys. That's his Vladdy's, uh, Vladdy, Eloy, Tatis, Juan. We're looking for all those boys in those. So, so the auto design on them though. Oh and yeah, the, the black. What differentiates? It's like on those uh, heritage. It'll be a blue ink or like a, a red different colored ink. ink. That's okay. it, man. That's it. It exactly. That's it exactly. We'll run through these uh, while he's going through those archives, chopping them up. Got Ozuna, Labor Day, Lindor. That's Seeger, 82. Oof. Where's here, Sam Arnold? Remind me where here is. Mr. Ozzy Albies and Biggio and Alonzo. Good day for the stars coming out. Tommy Edmond. Mr. Lariano. Alberto Mondesi. Hey, Nico Horner. Nice. Austin Meadows, Diamond King. And Bell and Brock Burke, Buster Posey, <laughs> Mr. Gigante Altuve, and the name variation, Nick Solak. Uh oh, do we get a hit in our retail pack? Or is this just a no? This is thick. Hey, look at that. And what a funky looking relic for the pirate. Did you see that? Jung Ho Kang. Nice hit. Nice hit. Nice relic card for the Pittsburgh Pirate. But man, what a what a let me get the autofocus on it. If it'll catch it. Oh, bless me. Whew. Bless you. Sorry, guys. I'm just torn around with this autofocus. Try to get it on, but it's almost like the uh the camo, if you can tell that digital brown camo print. Just being finicky today. 
Maybe it likes my hand more than the card. Ah, well. Logitech and their finicky cameras. Am I right? There we go. See what I'm saying? Like that digital print. Cool nonetheless, So Very cool. And into the reds with Arenado. Bless you, son. And Kettle Marte. Nice on the silver shimmer here. The hollow refractor with Aristides Aquino. What a nice box. Or fat pack, rather. Finish strong, Bradley. Toro. Jalen Davis. Jake Rogers. And Wade Boggs. Very good pack. We'll get those sleeved and loaded a little later. Start throwing me some archives cards, sir. Let's see what you're pulling. <laughs> Carlos, welcome, buddy. Good to see you. Andrew Cohen, nice to see you, man. Got suspended for KBO. I think he's in jail in Japan. <laughs> Free junk? <laughs> no, I don't even know. He might have done something egregious. Honestly, just kidding there. Honestly, just kidding there. All right. Okay, let's chop these in half and just start going. See who we got. Out of the 2019 archives. Tell you what, Ash, let's do this. I'm going to cut this. So I got a 2020 blaster, and if Ash would be so nice as to open and start the gathering on these. I'll go through the archives. We'll see what we got. Looks like Ian Desmond starting out. Nice. You say Kikuchi for Donald. Hey, Ron Barucki. Nice throwback there. Don Mattingly. Donnie Baseball. Nice throwback. Wow. Tris Speaker. Hey, look at this. Nice. Got one of those sweet little Expos uh, throwbacks with the stamp on them. Coco LaBoy. Very cool. And more. Back to Arenado with the Rockies. Got Willie Stargell. Got Rod Carew. Got the man, Jackie Robinson. Got Pee Wee Reese. Got the man, Willie McCove. Ralph Kiner, All-Star for Chris Sale, Louis Severino, got Colin Moran, Eddie Rosario, nice, I like that, just a good old clean picture, that's a good trout, Anthony Rizzo, nice Riz, J.D. Martinez, Paul DeJong, Miggy and Duhar and Haters Immaculate Inning. That's pretty cool. Holding tank. Get the second half of that blaster going. Yeah, those are nice. We'll have uh, we'll have those definitely make an appearance during a another Sunday sale, which again, apologies guys for cutting that a little bit shorter than I wanted. Um, but I'll probably try to condense those to about that time, about an hour and a half and, uh, try to get a little bit more into Thursdays, but I do appreciate everybody stopping in when we go live. Scooter Ichiro, uh, Cold Tucker Rook, Elvis Andrews, Nice Kyle Wright in the 93 style. Xander Bogarts. Fast man Billy Hamilton. Brad Keller. Hosmer. Hunter Infro. Ed Diaz. Max Muncy. Lorenzo Kane. Charlie Blackman. Eugenio Suarez. Orlando Cepeda. Oh, nice Ichiro there in the throwback for the archive. Very cool. Josh James, rookie. Nice. Kopech, nice rookie. Nice throwback. Nice Matthewson there. And Trey Turner. 
Nice rook for Colby Allard. Making come back. Like Soroka there. Jake Bowers. Nice A-Rod in his glamour shot. Looking all cute. Looking all cute. Like a senior cut. The Rock, Tim Raines. George Brett. Just watched him fight a couple men yesterday. He's not scared. Ryan O'Hearn about to lose his footing on the club if he's not careful. Oh, a little color on the border there for Mr. Bundy for all you Dirty Bird fans. There we go. Out of 175 for Dylan Bundy. Good, good, good hurler. There's Bryce Wilson. There we go. Pete Alonzo and the future stars. Very nice. Ha <laughs> ha. Neon Dion. There's the man. Oh, nice. Finish it off with a nice Shohei there. Very, very good on the archives. Very good archives box there. Definitely be seeing a lot of those pop up in the dollar sale, guys. I know there's a lot of good card in those uh, boxes, a lot of the good throwback players and currents also. And let's go through some. Don Russ blaster packs that Asher was so good to open. Parker, good to see you, buddy. Jaffa, good to see you too. Caleb Coffee, good to see you as well, sir. Guys, if you would give me a thumbs up, and if you're not already subscribed and have the bell to notify, uh, we're starting to put content out pretty regularly and uh, are dedicating two days to sales now. So if you haven't heard, um, Thursdays at 6 p.m. Eastern are a go. That's every Thursday. And uh, Sundays are going to alternate. Um, yesterday we had the late sale and that was 6 p.m. Eastern. So this Sunday is going to be uh, 3 p.m. Eastern. Uh, reason we're doing that is just to capture East and West Coast folks both within a month. So I feel like like if we change times a little bit, um, I know RSR is going on Sunday afternoon. Um, we may alternate that time a little bit, but it'll definitely be earlier. So look out for that. Keep your bells on. We'll look at some Don Russ cards here before we get out. I got Javi. Oh, very nice. Numbered Chris Bryant. Very cool. Out of 650 milestone. Nice Nick Solak rookie. <laughs> Old Higante there. And Tommy Edmond. Kirby Yates. Eddie Murray. Nice. Now playing in the shimmer for Jesus Lazardo. Buster Posey. Brock Burke. More Glaber Day. More Pete Alonzo. And Mitch Garver. Second to put these up as I am at minimal room for cards. And we'll keep going. Nice Tony Gwent Red. Sheldon Noyce. Oh, sorry, guys. Josh Bell. We've got Austin Meadows. There we go. Nico Horner. Marcelo Zuna. Andy Diaz, Eddie Rosario, and we go Trammell. Oh, nice. AJ Puck. I like that parallel. We'll definitely be seeing him Thursday. Nick Lofton sharing it with Alec Baum. Nice card. And Trout. And B squared for Bobby Bradley. Mookie Betts. Nice. Ron Acuna Jr. Trey Mancini, Max Kepler, Kirby Yates, Dominga Leba, Conforto with the Stars, Javi Baez, nice AJ Puck in the base, Mike Miner. Guys, if you're not already investing in AJ Puck um, and Dustin May, may I suggest? Prospecting's looking up, and according to the numbers that I'm seeing, everything's a go for those two. Okay, there we go. 
Nothing to perk you up like the old Yordan silver shiny in the hollow refractor. Clayton Kershaw and Bryce Harper. Dave Fletcher. Albert Pujols and Bryce Harper. We will definitely be seeing that nice rookies card in the hollow refractor for Mr. Alvarez. And second half, let's go through. And let's go, Robin Yunt. Nice. Juan Soto, the Diamond King. Sam Hilliard, rookie. Lorenzo Kane. Jorge Springer. Freddie Freeman. Tony Wynn. Purple, the Degrominator. Pretty cool. Reed Detmer shining with Brendan McKay. Nice. Yelly. Lance Lynn, Diamond King. Don't see that one a lot. Kevin Bidge, the man. Brian Anderson. Tommy Pham. Nice Tommy Edmund in the color. Galarraga. B squared, baby shark. Call it B cubed. Tony Gonsolin. Vladdy, the prodigal son. Ozzy Albies. Jose Barrios. Chris Paddock. Danny Mint. Okay. Danny. And my man, Trevor Bauer. We are going to pause. Guys, if you're not on YouTube uh, watching Trevor Bauer's videos, his conversations, his live BPs with Derek Dietrich right now following the guidelines, it's some of the best baseball while no baseball is being played. Um, I'm not saying that as a Reds fan. I'm saying that uh, everything from the Wiffle Ball League to his thoughts on Commissioner Manfred, um, rule changes, if you want an honest opinion, uh, you'll get it from Trevor Bauer. Then they go out and play fun baseball. Uh, like I said, if if you're not uh, if you're not following Bauer um, and you're not a Reds fan, don't worry. He's not, not going to inundate you with with um, with Reds fanery. Um, promise. Get on Bauer's uh, bus and make sure you're watching some of his videos right now. They're an absolute blast. Hey, there's Truth. Good to see you, buddy. Hope you're doing good. Doing well on the Memorial Day. Oh, wow. Nice uh, prospect here in the Silver Shimmer rated prospect, Dylan Carson. Very cool. And if you uh, needed to know how Tony Gwynn was born to his parents, look no further. He's Anthony Gwynn. Eugenio Suarez. Corey C. Alberto Mondesi. Ramon Laureano, The Rocket, Kettle Marte, nice, Brendan McKay, DeGrominator Base, LeMayhew, which by the way, uh, if you didn't see him, Papa Jay's uh, stream the other night, he landed me a very, very sweet numbered LeMayhew auto out of like 26, a real low number, um, hoping that gets shipped out quick, but uh, can't wait to get that in my greedy little hands. That looks cool. Robin Yunt. And oh, look what he saved. Dominic Leba with the autograph. Retail blasters provide. Retail provides. Very nice. Now, we all know if I would have opened that pack, there would have contained no autographs. So I only have my flesh and blood to thank for that hit. Asher, good job, sir. And they're releasing the regulations. I'm not getting back on the soapbox about youth sports in Kentucky, but they are saying it's opening back up. So as long as we're following a uh, stringent set of guidelines, we're going to play some baseball sooner than later. That's always awesome. That's always awesome. Go ahead and throw the autograph in a loader at least, and we'll definitely see that Thursday, guys, all the mids and highs. Got a lot of cards coming in. Got a couple Bowman Blasters. Got some 2017 high tech. And again, anybody joining? Um, I know Urban's break is full. I emailed him a little bit earlier and was just a little too late for his hot break. So um, got Papa J to slide me in a couple boxes after his break tonight. So whether you're at Urban's or whether you're at Papa J's tonight, 
Um, hit up somebody's channel in the community. Should be a pretty fun night. Um, he's going to open, uh, Papa J is going to open a 2017 gallery monster for me uh, with two autos and a 2018 Bowman Platinum with two autos after his mixer break. So uh, visit Urban's, visit Papa, hit them both. And uh, I'm sure I'll be drifting around in the channels. Um, with that being said, there was a little parenthetical in the title of the video, and it was for Chuck. Uh, did miss Chuck last night. Um, cut off a little too early in showing some stars and stripes cards. Um, figured never more appropriate on Memorial Day to go through a big chunk of stars and stripes cards. But um, after we do this, guys, I'm going to get signed off. Um, but I, I'm appreciative of everybody stopping in. The next sale is definitely going to be Thursday, uh, 6 p.m. Eastern. We're going to have a lot of new cards. Uh, we'll be breaking uh, as early as tomorrow. I'm off uh, next couple days, so uh, we may go live a little bit later than the evening. Uh, we may do it mid-late afternoon, but definitely be opening some new hobby boxes, introducing some new cards for the sales on Thursday. Our truth. You have a good day, man. Uh, I'm building up a lot of McKay's. Don't worry. Um, I'm definitely not short on the McKay's. You have a good day, sir. And I'll see you tonight in Urban's for a little bit, I'm sure. Uh, so with that, guys, um, just to catch you up, me and Chuck had been emailing back and forth um, about some Stars and Stripes cards that I didn't get to show him last night. So with that being said, guys, so you know what's going on. I'm getting ready to run through a big bulk of cards. Chuck, if you're still in here, um, you just sit tight and I'm going to show you all these cards and then we're going to email on prices. Um, we don't have to bicker about it here on the live. I just wanted to, I figured this might be the best streamlined way to show you all the cards and then we can, we can bicker about everything later. Um, but again, like I said, I can't thank y'all enough. Um, if you haven't given a moment to consider, um, Obviously, other than the COVID, why uh, you're not in school or not in work today. Uh, it's because a lot of brave men and women uh, signed a contract with our government to go do things that uh, you and I may never do and may never see. Um, very brave men and women. And they did not get to make it home to their sons, daughters, wives, and husbands to open any more baseball cards or go to any more games. Um, they're in tombstones. Um, they're in shrines all over the country. Uh, regardless of what your feel is on the U.S. military, um, you dang well better take at least one minute today uh, to remember that we would not be anywhere near the great country we are today um, if a lot of these men and women had not gone out and made the sacrifices that they made. It's our parents, it's our grandparents, it's our great-grandparents, it's our uncles and cousins and friends, and a lot of them that didn't get to make it home from certain conflicts and certain actions overseas, certain accidents here at home. Um, so by all means, guys, take a minute and, and if nothing else, be damn proud of our military. Um, it's full of nothing but brave men and women that are doing nothing but keeping our way of life going. And I'm sure appreciative and I, I really hope you guys are too. Um, and with that being said, uh, Chuck, I hope you're ready because all I'm going to do is just start throwing some stars and stripes cards this way. Um, Hey, thank you, Mango Goodness and Ice Cream. Uh, just on a non sequitur, I did see the story about how you developed your name, and I, that's a good joke. That's a good story. I like it. Uh, Chuck, I won't disagree with that. I won't force anybody's opinions on them, but um, I'm on YouTube broadcasting, buying cards and selling cards in a country. It leaves me pretty free to do so, and I know there's a lot of places I could wake up tomorrow and uh, wouldn't have those freedoms. Um so I'm, I'm obviously thankful. Uh, I don't expect everybody to be, but I'm sure hopeful that you understand that I am and why I am. And with that being said, Ash, I'm appreciative to you, man, pulling my hits for me. <laughs> no problem. He's going to go down to the basement and uh, get about 15 degrees cooler than it is here in the, in the spare card room, the card cave. Ash, we'll see you tomorrow, buddy. All right, buddy. I'll see you in a few minutes. You live here. <laughs> I'll see you on the channel tomorrow. Yeah. All right, guys. That's my lifeblood taking off, going back downstairs, get online. Chuck Dupree, this is for you, sir. I'm just going to start going through some stars and stripes. Anybody else welcome to sit and watch these young gents?
Here's longevity. Spencer Torkel. I'm um, sorry. Uh, Garrett Mitchell. Longevity. Matthew Mateus. Got Andrew Vaughn. Colt 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 Kowser Colt out of 212 autograph. Unnumbered Colt Wilcox. And Nate Savino. Alejandro Sacharo. That's a short. I missed Donald on. Shea Langoliers. Riley Green. Andrew Vaughn. Alec Burleson. Brennan Malone. Will Wilson. Uh, 2019 checklist. Carson. That is Bowen. Drew Bowser. Anthony Volpe. Patrick Bailey. I'm trying to keep these separated by what I think are the years between the 20s and the 19s that I've got, but I'll undoubtedly muck that up. And Steve Milam. Joseph Brown. Nolan McLean. Lucas Dunn. Adam Miller. Tanner Allen. Cade Cavalli. Corbin Carroll. Uh, Spencer, Luke Worrell, Dylan Lima, another Nate Savino, Hunter Haas, Lucas Corbin, uh, Reed Detmers, Ethan McElvain, Max Meyer, Austin Martin, and Robert Hassel. Thank you, Parker. Uh, I'm kind of like, uh, kind of like Chuck, and I love these stars and stripes prospects. And back into him, Mason Foyle, Avery Short, Dave Diaz, 18U checklist, Ryan Clifford, Mason Denneberg, Zach Thompson, Jack Jeter, Ryan Weathers. Caden Grenier, Josh Hartle, Brennan Malone, really strong, Timmy Manning, Will Wilson, Tyler Callahan, Carson Bowen, Steve Walker, Thomas DeLandry, this is a good one, Spencer Torkelson, Cody Schreier, Zach Watson. I say one of them is good. They're all potential pros, like I'm some. Schlub, Braden Shoemake. <laughs> you know what I mean. Stands out among the all-star studs and Olympians. <laughs> That's what I meant. All right. Charlie Som. Or Braden Shoemake. Tristan Casas. Kenyon Yovan. Dominic Fletcher. Kale Lansville. Jake Agnos. He's good. Christian Little. He's good. Drew Parrish, Kyle uh, Bornovich, Mason Fetal, Steel Walker, another Will Wilson, another Zach Watson, a couple Connor Scotts, Markel Landsville, Cody Schreier, Charlie Som, Luke Leto, Justin Clone, longevity for Christian Little. Longevity for Gabe Zeal. Uh, same for Josh Brown. 15U check. 18U check. And one more prompt stack. Kyle Brinovich. Longevity, Tanner Burns. Longevity, Tanner Karachi. Longevity, Drew Parrish. Longevity, Bryant Packard. Longevity, Nick Madrigal. Longevity, Zach Thomas. Longevity, Max Meyer. Longevity, Caden Grenier. Longevity, Daniel Cabrera. Longevity, Bryant Packard. Longevity, Nick Madrigal. Longevity, Dominic Fletcher. And I'll quit saying it till we get to out of longevity, but Max Meyer, Andrew Vaughn, Daniel Cabrera, 
Graham Stinson, Jake Agnos, Matt Cronin, Zach Watson, Ryan Rolson, Ryan Weathers, Avery Short, Timmy Manning, Nolan Gorman, Max Bajic, Tyler Callahan, uh, numbered longevity to 249 for Weathers, uh, Anthony Volpe, Raleigh Cornello, Yohandy Morales, Mason Denneberg, Ethan Hankins, Jack Jeter, Ryan Rolson, Jacob Meter, Brennan Malone, Ryan Clifford, Connor Scott, Braden Shoemake, and Nolan Schubert, numbered to 249. And I believe that is everything that I've got for sale in the Stars and Stripes. You got that right, Apex. You missed a couple of uh, Blackmans, I believe, sir. Um, but I'll roll those back around. And I still got that uh, acetate that I'm holding for you. Um, so if you've got my email and you want to send me an email, um, I can probably dig those Blackmans back out tonight. They weren't anything special, just some ones that we'd rolled through today, uh, opening some archives and uh, Don Russ blasters. Um but we got lucky in the retail, so good for Derek. Um, so Chuck, I appreciate you letting me show you these cards. Um, by all means, send me an email, and you can you can offer me a price on the whole lot, or if there were certain cards uh, that you're interested in. I'm just not sure how much you wanted to collate. Um, but I'd be more than happy to send one or send all those your way. Um, just let me know what you were thinking. Chuck, I do, uh, um, but unfortunately, I've got to hold those till Thursday. Um, one reason is I don't have all the Tebow yet. Um, I've got two more coming. One was pulled and one was purchased. Uh, one was numbered, um, but I've got. I will have. Uh, I will have a couple of Tebow, two or three more Tebow cards here. Um, to have him. I want to say three or four at least a pro debut uh, and a few more. But right now, I do not. A brisk walk, man. I don't want to say I'm getting soft, but I got to get back into the summer shape because uh, that temperature outside taking a brisk walk might have to call for help halfway through. Of course, it felt like it was just hotter than hell today anyway. It got up in the 80s here, but where it's been raining for the past four days, it felt like a Vietnamese jungle. Okay. Yeah, that'll be fine, Chuck. And obviously you can email um, with your stack and I can't eyeball it. Yeah, I can. You just got a couple cards rolling. And um, if I'm not holding you up on getting the ones that you've already purchased, you're more than welcome to roll them to the next sale, obviously, and uh, see what we got Thursday and make your decision. And if you want me to hold any of these USA cards, um, we'll just roll them into that also if you're wanting to shop on Thursday. Uh, we'll work out a deal on these and I'll hold everything, let you shop Thursday and you're already paid in for shipping. So we'll just, we'll just know that we're taken care of there. I'm going to, um, Andrew, um, I haven't separated them yet, man. And I, to be honest, um, what, if you were at the sale yesterday, you saw, I mean, the judges and all the Yankees, but they just haven't been separated yet, buddy. Have not got to do that. Yeah, that's no problem, Chuck. Again, no pressure on him. Again, I, I, I cut the sale short. I told everybody it's going to go two hours, but um, like I said, after a 12-hour shift and an hour and a half on the sale, my voice wasn't going to cooperate much more. And um, once that goes, I'm a horrible salesman, but I did. I'm, I'm glad you came back and at least let me show them to you, like I said, but no no pressure on him. I just, just want to follow through and make sure that you saw him. So thank you for that. Um, Apex on that acetate, it would be $9 shipped, but what you could do is if it, if, uh, you pay the $9 for the card and the shipping, you can come back Thursday and shop for free at the big sale. 
uh, where I've got the numbered cards and the autos and most of the higher end stuff, the graded's. Um, you can do that, but it, it hasn't gone anywhere. The only other thing is it would be available for sale Thursday if you didn't want it. So again, no pressure. It's just $9 shipping and I could send it out to you tomorrow or you can come back and shop Thursday at the big sale and I'll ship it out to you on uh, Friday or Saturday, however you would like to do it. And you've got my email. I'll put it up here one more time in case anybody wants to talk about any prices privately or anything like that. Also be a good time to make any request. Breakers are us. Good to see you, sir. Thank you for joining. Um, Andrew, I haven't forgotten about you, sir. I just haven't literally separated any Yankees out. And if it's just for trading, it'll probably be one of the latter tasks that I get to this evening. Um, but if you can recall any of the ones I did pull that Turkey red judge out for you, um, I hadn't come across that other Floreal, but I know I've got, I've got a few Floreals now. Um, actually, I'm lying to you. I could show you um, the one that we didn't get last time was that numbered Floreal uh, out of two, I'm sorry, out of 250. Then I've got the Prismatic Prodigies and Bowman uh, Platinum. We've got a few of those each separated out and then... Um, and then I've showed you, I've showed you the Yankees before with the, uh, I mean, I've showed you the Glabers and Andahars and stuff. Those are the, those haven't changed. Um, but we'll have some cards uh, coming up on surprise for Thursday for sure. Um, I don't want to spoil it, but we've got, we're starting to move into some higher end cards. Uh, definitely have all the cards that you want for cheap. I'm definitely not getting out of that market. I have too much fun doing that. Um, I'll build some more of those hot lots for $10. I've got plenty of rookie cards and hot prospects to do that. So um, with that being said, I make sure this email is correct, guys. And if it's not, please make sure that. Could I throw in the Floreal number to make our deal even? I thought we were even already, Andrew. Where am I behind trade? I thought we were. I thought we were traded, caught up, and you were keeping tabs on that trade. I was. I didn't think I was behind at all in that. Yeah, Vikings ninety five is a good source for football. Um, Deafness forty five. If you're not on his, um, Deafness is another one that'll get into some football and basketball. Um, and help me out, guys. Anybody else? Yeah, Carlos, I've got new Soto. Yep, I sure do. Oh, uh, I don't know about the numbered Florial. I'll throw a regular one in there, Andrew. I'm not. I don't think I want to put a numbered Florial in there to cover a base. Um, pick one of pick either the prismatic prodigy or the Bowman if you want one of those, or um, that's me, man. That's where I'm at. Apex Hall of Fame, okay. Uh, yeah, Papa Jay's another one, and Urban, both of them have sites, um, seem to get pretty good prices. Andrew, you're killing me. This is a dollar card, sir. Pick either Prismatic Prodigy or Base. Which one of those, Andrew, will catch us up, sir? Prodigy? All right. So that'll get me caught up. And it looks like with the sales and trading, I've gotten in over my head. So, Andrew, if this gets us caught up, I think that makes me even with everybody. So I'm going to put a pause to trading and go straight sales for a little bit.
I hope that doesn't upset anyone, but with that sale, me getting scrambled last night and getting hung up in email, multiple trades back and forth. Andrew, if we're good on this, getting caught up. Um, I tell you what I'll do just so that, you know, I'm not a hair bit upset about it. I want to, we'll make sure I get both of those in there to get us caught back up. And this will help me by calling a pause to the trades. Will let me focus on the sales a little bit more and deliver a little bit better service. Andrew, I appreciate the good trades that you've given me, sir. You've done me awfully fair. A good store to supply new boxes. Um, breakers, I've got to be honest, I was pretty lazy about the matter up until recently. Um, I could always hit Amazon as a prime member and for, it seemed like around, in the beginning, around 13 bucks, get 100 top loaders and sleeves uh, shipped for free. But the last time I checked, uh, Amazon uh, sellers weren't going to be back in stock till the 28th. And those prices have basically doubled. So I'm looking at about $25 um, top loaders and sleeves. Oh, Andrew, you're not bugging me at all, buddy. Th this is for me. This, this lets me call a, a clean break. It, it's no bother. This is one of the reasons that we do it. I've said from the beginning that I want to trade and I want to sell. But just like the way I call a clean break with my shipping and with the sales dates, it's no different than that. We're going to get back into trading. All I mean is this is just a clean line to draw until we can get back in it. It's no bother at all, buddy. I like trading those reds cards back and forth with you. I didn't, I didn't want you to take it that way. Got a TCG store in town. That's I go to my Walmart um, and we'll find, actually, I just picked one up today. They have odds and ends in supplies. Um, but it's basically these boxes, if you can see them back here, they come with a few top loaders and sleeves and those, but I need those boxes anyway for the sale. And other than that, it's more geared towards like Pokemon, like colored and floral. I'm um, just, just sleeves that wouldn't be appropriate for baseball. That's me, man. I'm, I'm trading supplies. That's actually where I got the idea for those $10 hot lots um, was having to move. Uh, if you can imagine, like I had a 160 point uh, top loader on a, like an 80 or, or 110 point card. So I would just take the smaller relic out, put four or five regular rookies in there and move the relic to a smaller top loader that would fit. I'm having to, I'm <laughs> having to move resources around to make everything fit. But heck, if that's the worst of my problems and I'm surely blessed. Oh, you'll know, Andrew, we're good, buddy. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We'll get these uh, shipped back and forth. And that'll give us some time to collect up some more cards. Actually, that's that's not a bad thing. Like one of the bourbon co-ops that we're in, we're having the same problem. We've all traded uh, so many good whiskeys back and forth to each other that we're having to wait a few weeks to start trading again just to, just to let the inventories build. So it's not a bad thing. Honest, Andrew, don't, don't take it that way. Buddy. I do uh, Apex sometimes. I, I shouldn't say sometimes. I'm just, I'm not averse to trades at all. Um, I collect the reds and the the hot rookies and prospects. Um, what I, I and I have been in current trades with a few members here in the community. Um, I, yeah, where, where I'm, I'll get right back into it pretty soon. But I do like trade. This will just be a short period of time that I'm not going to trade to get organizationally back into it, get all my cards caught up and sorted and organized and making sure that I'm not finishing each day a uh, half day behind. Our LCS just opened. Uh, it's minutes away. I found out there is an LCS in Huntington, West Virginia, across the bridge. It's expensive. Oh, it's expensive. So expensive. If I hadn't told that story, um, you guys know probably what you could get a 2020 Don Russ hobby box for. Um, I sent a message to this new LCS that's trying to open and start their business. And that was a question. Just, I already knew what I could get uh, a Don Russ hobby from or 
blowout. I knew what the current prices were. Asked him, and at the time when they were still selling for eighty dollars shipped, uh, he came back and quoted me a price of one twenty, and I almost dropped the phone. So I messaged him back and said, "Are you sure? You know what I mean? Just to make sure it wasn't a typo or that he didn't misunderstand that I was asking, you know, for a different year or something." I said, "Are you sure?" You know, he came back and said, "Yeah, I've still got a couple of those left if you want them." My gosh. Not even if my son was a debut player, would I want those at 120? Uh, I, I like to I like to support the LCS, but I cannot do it at forty dollars extra a hobby box. I I'm not that wealthy. I don't make that kind of money. I don't imagine y'all do either. I don't care a bit to go and support the LCS. It's going to charge their premium, you know, a few dollars on top of a box and you know a dollar on top of a pack or something. But you can't try to make all of your profit off of one customer. Hobby's too good for that. With that, guys, it sounds like I've been on a soapbox, but I surely haven't. I'll climb off of it if it sounds like it. It's been a fun Memorial Day. Went up to the in-laws. Uh, my sweet mother-in-law had a key lime pie for me, grilled out some hamburgers. Uh, blessed with good father and mother-in-law. So with that, guys, I hope y'all's Memorial Day has been good. and hope it's been thoughtful, thought-invoking at the very least. I'm going to jump off. I'm going to get my customer hands ready. Uh, I'm going to stop in Urban's tonight. I know he's got a good break going. Then I'll be in Papa Jay's. Again, if you haven't heard, uh, after his mixer, he's going to open a 2017 Monster with a couple autos and a 2018 Bowman Platinum Monster with a couple autos. So we'll spice up his fun break. And guys, if you haven't already on your way out, please hit the like and subscribe and bell button. That lets me know you guys know uh, you'll be in tune if I decide to change times or go live impromptu. Uh, so thank y'all. Appreciate it. Uh, thank y'all for letting me show you baseball cards. And I'm starting to see you guys in the lives tonight. All right, Apex. I'll see you there. Absolutely, Apex. Happy Memorial Day.